Hello everyone. Welcome to Java Code Trades. Today we are going to discuss how to find even an odd number without using the modulus operator. So in previously we know like uh, uh, we are checking like if my number is completely divisible by two and if I get a remainder as zero, then we are considering it as a even number. Otherwise it will odd number. But uh, but without modulus operator, how we can? So let's think on this. Okay, here uh, I'm considering first even number. Okay, so I'll take number as a four. So what I'm going to thinking if my particular number is divisible by two, then what is the result uh, we are getting? We are getting as a two, correct? And again, I try to multiply by uh, that result into two, then I'm getting that same number, correct? So same logic I'm going to do uh, here. Uh, my um, so what I'm going to do first, uh, a number is divisible by two. And multiply by two, and, and then I'll compare uh, the my number and result. If both are equal, then I consider it as a even number. Let's check for let's check for the odd number. Let's consider it as a five. Five divided by two. What is the result we are getting? Two point five. Correct. And multiply by um, multiply by two. It will get as a five. But uh, the change here is like we are using an integer. Correct. So in integer, the floating number is not considered. So it consider it as a two. So 2 into 2 will get a result. So what will happen here? 0. 0.5 will be removed. So result will get as a 4. Correct? So let's build this solution. Uh, so for this, uh, to building this solution, I have created one method, find even and odd, which is accepting uh, accepting one parameter as a number. Correct? And we are returning uh, as a string. Okay. So uh, let's, I write my condition over here first. Number is divisible by 2. and its result is multiplied by 2. Okay. Number is divisible by 2 and, and multiply that result by 2 is, is equal to is equal to my number. Correct. So then I'll consider it as a even. Correct. So I'm going to write here if statement. Okay. If this condition got true, then we are returning even. Otherwise, we are returning odd. Okay, okay that's it, correct. Uh, let's uh, run our code. So, in the sysout statement, I'll try to find even an odd number and we are passing this 4. So, let's try it. Number is even correct. Let's try for the 5 into 3. That's good. Let's try for 100. Number is even. And let's try for 101. Number is odd. Correct. So, you got my point. Uh, so, what we are doing, uh, we are just uh, applying two conditions here. Uh, the number uh, we are uh, div uh, dividing by two, and again the result multiplied by two. And if my result uh, number is same, then I will consider it as a even. Uh, otherwise, it, it is odd. Yeah. 